To create a 4K vertical sequence for Instagram Reels, TikTok, and YouTube Shorts, you'll need to head down to New Item and then Sequence. Or you can click Command plus N on a Mac or Control plus N on a PC. Now in this dialog box, let's make sure we're in the Settings tab. For editing mode, I've edited all of my video projects, YouTube or otherwise, with the DSLR option and haven't found any reason to need to change it. For frame rate, I leave it at 23.976, but of course, depending on the video project you're working on, you may want to change the frame rate of the timeline for one reason or another. Now for the most important part the aspect ratio of the timeline. Right now, you'll see a 4K horizontal aspect ratio with it saying 3840 horizontal by 2160 vertical. This is of course a 16 by 9 aspect ratio. In order to change this to a 4K vertical aspect ratio, we need to switch these two numbers so that it says 2160 horizontal and 3840 vertical. And now you'll notice it says 9 by 16 on the end here which is the exact aspect ratio we're looking for. Everything else in the settings tab can remain exactly the same, and if you don't want to have to do this every single time, you can save this as a preset down here. I actually already have my 4K vertical sequence already saved as a preset, and we'll go ahead and open it up to see how it looks. Now if you want to edit this 4K vertical sequence in a much larger workspace than we have currently, head to this icon here for workspaces, and choose vertical. Now just as an example, let's drag this vertically shot 1080p stock footage onto the timeline. And when this pops up, make sure to click keep existing settings. Now you notice the vertical video is not only still laid out horizontally, but it's also too small for the vertical sequence since it was filmed in 1080p and not 4K. It's really easy to correct this. First make sure your clip is highlighted and then head over to effect controls where we will rotate the clip 90 degrees. From here, we will then increase the video scale until it fills out the entire 4K vertical frame. Around 202 seems to do the trick. Of course, this number may vary on your end. And there you have it. Thanks for watching, liking, and subscribing, guys. For more short form vertical content tips and tricks, including infinite loops and export settings, head over to the playlist on the screen now, and I'll see you there.